So my civilization was located in Tiki. Uh, Tiki is in between two strips of mountains. Uh, the mountains are really important to Tiki because they protect the tribe of Tiki from other tribes. Um, another geographic feature that is important to Tiki is the rivers. The rivers are basically the support of their life. It makes the farmland around it fertile and it gives them a direct source of water to drink. Uh, my civilization does have religion. They, they worship their rivers pretty much as if they are a god and they also worship the rivers <coughs> for their protection. So they didn't necessarily believe in human formed gods. They believed in their resources as gods. Um, I do have a social class within my tribe. There is builders, farmers, scribes, craftsmen, warriors, and royals. The royals and the scribes are at the top of the hierarchy because the scribes are used as almost spies and they report back to the royals to give them information. The royals <coughs> control pretty much everything that goes on. They're strict but fair. They try to make everything fair but not equal necessarily because if everything was equal then they could be overthrown. Um, the warriors are next down in the social hierarchy. They protect the village and they'll attack other tribes if needed. But their main job is just protecting. They want to stay isolated and not really interact with other tribes unless absolutely needed. The farmers and builders are at the bottom of the social hierarchy. The farmers, the farmers are not treated terrible though. Every night at the end of each day, everyone in the Tiki tribe will meet up and they'll all have dinner together, actually. So they're not treated absolutely terrible. They do have to work really hard, everyone in civilization, but the royals definitely do have more power. They decide everything, like I said earlier, that goes on. Uh, the builders, they'll take, they'll take uh, clay from the rivers. There's a river right there, and if I tilt this, you might be able to see it better. There's a river right here. The builders take the clay from that to build every part of town, including their buildings. Uh, without the clay, they'd be they'd be building buildings with like sticks and things, and they'd be a little less developed, to have less security with their buildings, and their buildings might fall apart. Uh, Another feature that I have in my civilization is there's lots of like flatlands, but there's also hills. Uh, the hills, they'll terrace farm and grow grains and crops on them. So what they did is they cut into these hills to build surfaces for farming. Uh, I don't really think I have anything else. That moves, and this is the sun, and it rises and sets each day. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Wow. Tiki. Yeah. Tiki. And what's on the outside of your mountain? Oh, okay. Uh, Thank you. So located in the mountains, and the Incans were much like this. They located their civilization in the mountains. <laughs> for the protection of it from other tribes, so yeah.